Welcome back. I guess we're going to film a little little vlog here today. We went and got ourselves a kayak. And uh, we're going to have some kayaking videos next year for sure. Been wanting one for a while. A friend of mine took me out and uh, was definitely hooked. So we went and got ourselves one. It's that time of year where they're getting rid of them and there's some deals. And now I'm home. We hillbillied it. Did a little hillbilly job on it. She's only hanging out about six and a half foot or so. But uh, I'll get yourself some merch. Teespring.com. The stickers don't come like that though. They come on a like a square, and I I just cut it out real quick. So I don't know what the deal is with that, but. Uh, We'll take a closer look at this once we get it unloaded. And then we're uh, going to see if I installed these uh, hooks a long time ago, four of them in the ceiling, because I used to have a Jeep Wrangler. So I used to back in and would suspend the top, the hard top. Well, I think that's going to work out all right just to pull the kayak up in the air so you can walk underneath it. So we'll see. We'll see, but we'll get her unloaded to start with. All right, let's get her unloaded. Flip the hitch upside down. Kind of did a little, like I said, hillbilly job here, but it worked all right. As we almost lose it. Uh, this kayak is 49 pounds. So not real heavy. Bring you in for a closer look. So this is the Wilderness Systems Pungo 120, it's a 12 foot kayak, got this one lightly used. What I like is it's got a really comfortable seat, fully adjustable back, all this is adjustable, you got adjustable little foot pedals, um, this is your dry storage. It's really good shape so looking forward to getting out this year we're definitely going to be filming some good kayak videos so anyways we're going to carry this into the garage and see if we can't uh, suspend it up in the air if those hooks will work they're not perfectly placed like i would like but i think they'll be good enough all right, we got our straps on the ceiling. So in theory, in theory we'll put the kayak, set it on them and then we'll pull and raise it up to the ceiling. See how, see how that works, I guess. We'll see, might be a little sketchy. Might be. A little sketchy. This is going to be interesting. Whew. 
Whew. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to have enough room. This might be a little, might be a little rough. All right, well, a garbage toter works pretty good to set yourself up. But my concern is there's not a lot of room for the nose before we're going to be hitting that cabinet, but then we can get beyond that cabinet once we get higher. So let's see. Let's see what this cluster turns into. feels heavier than 49 pounds. Alright, right, let's see if we can get this up there. Boy, it does feel like more than 49 pounds though. Okay, this might actually work. <laughs> this might actually freaking work. Okay, I think that's as far as we're going to want to go. But that's actually pretty well balanced. That strap is just adjusted higher. All right, well, let's see. This is not gonna be the most fun to be adjusting, I don't think. I think we can get this where we want it without it freaking falling. Let's get to this other side now and then we can shift it. I don't know if you guys are interested in this chaos, but I figured why not show you uh, what I got going on today. I think that might work. I used to have a bike hanging right there. I don't know that I'm going to be able to put that back up. But... That worked out. Oh yeah, that's plenty high. I'm only 5'10", but man, there's, there's a foot and a half over me, so. That worked out. Um, like I said, I don't think that bike's gonna go back up unless I can sneak it behind it. Might be able to. 
Let's see what that cluster looks like. Maybe. Maybe not. Does that work? I don't know. You gotta worry about walking into this, so I don't know that I'm a fan of that. Hmm. Well, we'll think about it. Anyways. I hope you enjoyed this short little vlog, kayak in the garage, hillbillied it for about 60 miles on the way home, stick it about six and a half foot outside of the truck, but we made it. We made it. She's looking pretty good. Until next time, we'll see you.